Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Word. In this module, I want to show you how you can collapse paragraphs out of the way so you can just see the headings throughout a whole document. Now, the first thing you need to do to achieve this is create heading styles. So what I've done there, this is a heading style. Heading style one, you can see it there. And this heading is a heading style two. Now, these are not the default settings. If I right click on heading style two, for example, and modify, I have changed this to be this font, this size bold. And that is what I've said. And I also don't want it to have spaces before or after. So you can go into format paragraph and you can see that I've changed that. That is not the default. When you first get Microsoft Office, there will be settings in here and possibly in there as well, depending which style you use. So you can edit all of these and then use them as you wish. I've not uh, edited this one, so let's have a quick look. So that's blue, different font altogether, format, paragraph, and that just has a small space before each paragraph. So that's what you would have to edit if you didn't want that space. But the, the process of using them is quite simple. If I just get myself a blank document and type introduction for a minute. So that's just a normal text, normal font. There is normal. But if I want that to be heading style one, for example, or heading style two, I just click on the heading style and you get this little triangle in front of it. When I press enter, it not normally goes back to the normal function and you can see it there now sometimes when you've got your own styles which I have there if I put that to that one which is a bit weird see you see the spacing before and after on that one now when I press enter on that it stayed on that style and it probably would do the same on all of these that I've created that one if I press enter on this one that stayed on that style Steve so unless you change it so it's based on one of these you're going to have that problem or you're going to have to manually click off it. But if you're selecting one of these ones, like that one, when you press enter, it goes back to normal, which is great. So if I just control W, close window, and then I'm going to press the letter N for don't save, because that's what that means. N on the keyboard, don't save, back to this one. Now, once you've created heading styles, you can manually click on these little triangles and it will collapse the paragraph underneath if I just expand them again so that's how it can collapse a paragraph out of the way but if I go to the view tab and tick navigation pane I'll get the whole structure of the document there and if I click on these little triangles I'll, I'm achieving the same sort of thing there collapsing the whole structure down but it's not collapse this down if I go down this and collapse all of this down you get the same benefit but normally you want to collapse one, one paragraph out of the way that's the same as what you've got there and then you can open that up click onto a very uh, a relevant section and then it, it navigates as it says navigation to the relevant section benefits part two etc etc and then expand each bit so that's how you can expand and collapse parts of paragraphs you need to use heading styles so you can do that and then you've got these little triangles on there the heading styles come from the the home tab and depending what kind of company you've got you might have quite a few in there different styles but the heading styles that come one two and three are the basic ones that usually come with Microsoft Office and then the ones there are other ones that you can view if you want to but those are the ones that you normally sit in this styles box so hopefully that little video was of use, how to collapse a paragraph and hide it, in this case by using heading styles. So hopefully you found it useful, I'll catch you on the next one, thank you for your time.